fellow gamers of Gamersphere, I am Brad Austin, and this is Dark Souls 2 Scholar of the First Sin. I have been waiting for this game because, number one, I love From Software and I love their games. Um, this, once I, I have not started this game yet, I have no way to continue. I just popped it in, just let it finish installing. I want to have this video up for day one, for the day one. Uh, you know, it just released and all that. I'm super excited because I never got to play any of the DLC, all of the Crown DLCs. And so, I figured it would be goodbye. Besides, once I begin this game, it will be my fourth time playing through Dark Souls 2. That is how much I love From Software and their games. I've spent over 240 hours in between Dark Souls 1 and Dark Souls 2. I absolutely love them. I'm gonna get the settings here. And so... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Camera flip, normal, normal, sensitivity, vibration, yes, auto adjust, target, blah, blah, voice chat. Cross region play. I like voice chat, but I won't be, yeah, might as well, might as well, all the volume, I don't want it to like start the game as soon as I, hey, okay, here we go, uh, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I give you Dark Souls 2. Perhaps you've seen it, maybe in a dream, a murky forgotten land. A place where souls may mend your age. You will lose everything once branded. The symbol of the curse. An augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. None will have meaning, and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why.
like a moth drawn to a flame. Your wings will burn in anguish. Time after time. Is your fate the fate of the cursed? go that's the attic it looks it's hard to tell the graphical differences oh my gosh nope or maybe it's just placebo effect i don't know but it looks a lot better the colors are more vibrant Things betwixt, a limbo between worlds. My goodness, and I'm playing with headphones. I've never, never been able to play Dark Souls with my headphones before. Ah, uh, everything just feels so good. I know it's the exact same game I played on my 360, but for some reason, I'm very happy to finally have it on my Xbox One now. Um, if I remember right, there are some items out here. Let's see. No. It's not over there. I know there's something. Aha, there's a cave. There it is. A rusted coin. Well, that doesn't actually do anything, but I did know there was something out here. Oh God, this is so good. So what I was thinking about doing is I would love to make this just a full series, just a big playthrough of the game. So, but if not, if that doesn't work out, maybe I'll turn this into like a guide of some kind. But if for no other reason, then I just wanted to share some day one, excuse me, some day one footage with you. Here's the fire keepers. <laughs> what seems to be the ruckus? Oh my, your face. The face of the curse. It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> You're finished. You'll go hollow. Yes. You will become one of them. Hollows prey upon men, feast upon their souls. This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> <laughs> Try and recall your name. Yeah, Brad. Super simple. Yep, that works. <laughs> At least you know your own name. Here's your reward for sharing. It's a human effigy. 
take a closer look. Who do you think it's supposed to be? Think back, deep into your past. Yes, it's an effigy of you. All right, now comes the character creation. I'll probably skip over most of this. Uh, let's see, class. I want something with a shield. My re most recent um, playthrough on my 360 is with the Deprived. You start out with literally nothing. It's pretty cool. strength and dexterity. It's funny, you can tell how Japanese this is just by all the hairstyles. See, my problem is I could do character customization for a good 30 minutes. I mean, you got all these advanced settings that you know I'm going to go through. There's no getting around it.
What's funny is I know this doesn't... This isn't gonna matter at all. I'm never gonna see my character like this. It's on and all the good stuff. Still. Alright, well, this is our guy. He's got purple hair because I'm weird like that, so. Here we go. Ready to do this. Finish creation. Done. This is my true self. Yes. That only took oh, ten minutes. Here for the same reason. To break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Hmm. Doesn't stand a chance. Well, you never know. <laughs> <laughs> through the door and trot along to the kingdom. But remember, hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going home. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. creepy old ladies. Well, enough with the cinematics. Let's get to playing the game. I know there's something up here. Alright, let's see. Let me go to my, uh, notebook. <clears throat> what do I got? This is, this is everything I have. Just making sure that I got on all the best equipment possible. There, I never use the dark sign. Everything is in order. All right, let's get the heck out of here. I think this lady gives me something if I talk to her enough. So. This is a limbo, a link between Drangleic and the outer world. Fair traveler, I know that you must have a story. I don't know, do I? Why else would you visit such a place? Because I am cursed. Lost. I'm Decay. undead. The kingdom. My name is Millibeth. Hi, Millibeth. The old women were once fire keepers. I am here to look after them. It is what my mother did, and her mother before her. Do I not get anything? The old women were keepers of the fire, but now the fire shows signs of fading. And the kingdom is beset by hollows. The old women are sisters. I am told there was a fourth. Long ago, fire keepers were commonplace. Yeah, and Dark Souls 1. But now they are lost, scattered to the winds. The old women... Okay, so that's it. She doesn't give me anything. Sorry, I kind of wasted some time there. All right, ladies, I'll leave you to it. Shut this behind me, I'll be polite. I'll be a nice gentleman. And here's our first bonfire, right? Yes! Let's just say. Bonfires are, oh yeah, so this is the tutorial area. But, enough with the cinematics. Let's get on to the gameplay, see how it's like. Oh my goodness, they weren't kidding, it does look a whole lot better. Wow. Alright, I know this is a tutorial area and I really don't need to do it. But I'm going to anyway, just um, to get the extra souls, what little it may offer. I wouldn't consider myself a Dark Souls master, not by stretch at all. But I do know a lot of the game. And 
And I'm pretty confident that, uh... I'm pretty confident in my skills by now. I feel like I can rely more on skill rather than you know, leveling up. With the time and patience, I could take on the first boss right now. That's not gonna happen. These guys are easy. I want to get... I don't like this broken sword. I mean, it's doing fine against these regular hollows, but... Oh. I don't know if you guys can see. I feel like my... I feel like my screen is really dark. It seems to be a problem. I should have seen that guy, but I didn't. And these guys are giving me no souls at all. I know how to move the camera. Good. You, you, give a smooth. No. We'll go back. I'm kind of a completionist. It's a, uh, it's a gift and a curse. I spend so much time doing things that don't really matter, but at the same time, it gives me a lot of really cool weapons and gear. It always definitely pays off. I saw you come. I can't see. You. Ooh. See, my screen is way too dark. Hang on, I gotta do something. Cause I, I, I was about to walk. Uh, it's sad that I have to do that, but dang. I should have remembered that it's my fourth time saying it. From Dark Souls 1. It was, you hold the sort of sprint, and then you tap B again to jump if you're using a control. That was just a terrible decision. That made for... Difficult. What the heck? A statue blocks my way. What? This isn't. That's new. That's very new. That hasn't happened. That's never happened to me before. What the heck? Great, so that statue is in my way. Petrified. Can I go anywhere else? Hey, look, there's a shadow dude up there. I forgot I'm in online mode. Hang on. I want to go through all these fog doors, but I don't know how to get through that guy. I think. You, you, you... Give it me. Shut up, bird. I guess they have this area locked off now. We're gonna have to come back with a fragrant branch of yore. Well, that sucks. Well, on to Majula. Let's see just how beautiful this game is once we get to this next area. Read message. Oh, messages are coming up. Praise the sun and then praise the sun. Yep, now the real fight begins. There's no illusion here. There's no illusion here. It's a troll. It's a troll, I tell you. That's one thing people will do in Dark Souls. They'll troll you to death. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, look at how beautiful it is. Majula. Majula, Majula. Good luck. May the force be with you. Oh my gosh. It's running so smooth. This looks really good. I mean, it looked it looked good on the 362, but oh my gosh. There's an item up here. 
Where is it? There it is. Found it. Oh my god. I can't believe how good this looks. Ah, and hello, Majula. We're gonna go talk to a few people first. We're gonna go see about the... The armor over here. Uh, oh. oh hello there. He stutters a lot. W welcome to my uh, shop. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. I could really use the business. Alright, fine. I can't afford anything. You won't see me again. No, I'm, I'm There's a Titanite shard up here. That's gonna come in handy. I'm just trying to roll off it. How did somebody die here? Oh. They went out and pissed off the pigs. Oh. He ran right into that pit just because. I know there's an item over here in this one. If I knock this down. Up comes a... What is this? That's this flash shard. Uh, talk to Shaquar the cat. Oh. I'm dead, dead and one without much time remaining. Just about ready to fall apart, I'd say. Not exactly the time to be chatting with a cat. No, you're right. Oh, this yes. This is the time to... You may call me Shalqua. Hello, Shalqua. So, what did you want, anyway? Ooh, you smell wonderful. <laughs> I want... Nothing suited you, I presume? No, oh, ma'am, nothing suited me. Just fine. Thank you. Alright, we'll quit farting around. We're gonna go talk to the... The Emerald Herald. First, I'm gonna talk to this guy. Who are you? Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm Brad. Just help me open this door. All right. I packed my tools in here. Seeing it was vacant, but now somebody's gone and locked the door. Doesn't that sound a lot like, uh... Uh, Ian McKellen? I'm a blacksmith. Sounds like Gandalf. Without my tools. Or nothing. Treat me like key. Fine, I'll bring you your key and your staff. Great. Oh, wait. I gotta light this bonfire. What am I doing? <laughs> Look at me, my purple hair it looks all weird. What's up, lady? Are you the next monarch? Could be. Or merely a pawn of fate. Staring out into the wilderness. Bearer of the curse. I will remain by your side till this frail hope shatters. Take this with you. May it ease your journey. Is the Estus Flask shard? Yes, it is. I get one. To see the king. He who made Drang Lake what it once was. He who peered at the essence of the soul. King Vendry. You may level up by the power of the Emerald Herald. Yay, thank you, Emerald. I need to equip the uh, Essence Flash. Okay, let's see. I think that's everything, really, that I wanted to equip. I haven't gotten anything else. Terror of the curse. Seek misery, for misery oh. will lead you to greater, stronger souls. I love how they just basically... You'll never meet the king with a soul so frail and pallid. They just make fun of the fact that this game is very hard. Seek those whose names are unutterable. The four endowed with immense souls. Their souls will serve as beacons. Yes, Once yes, you yes. have found them, return here to me, so that hope will not fade away. So I was talking about hope fading. Is that a shard you found? Yes, it's a shard. Here. I found it in that well Let over there. see it. To see light. To see hope. However right. faint it might be. Finally. I don't want to skip over all the dialogue, but some of it can just go on forever. 
I don't even have enough souls to level up. Wait, I have... I have one soul here. <laughs> even that's not gonna cut it. Is it? No, I think it was like 900. Oh my god. Over the hill and past the forest is the king's castle. Oh, you mean that over there? And peered straight into the essence of the soul. But whatever came of it. Oh my god, this game does look a whole lot better. I just can't get over it still. Alright. Sit down. We're gonna sit down right here. Because we took some damage. And here we go. On our first stretch of the adventure. I think I'll stop once I reach the next bonfire. And I'll see what you guys think. I'll upload this video, and if it gets a good response, then I'll do more of this. Because I would love for this to be just a complete playthrough. You know, a whole video series. But, um, that's why we're going to need you to like it up and share the video. You know, show your friends. If you want a guide, here it is. But... Views just aren't enough, you know. You can be along for the ride, but you gotta, you know, a show of hands is what tells you what's what, you know. So hit that like button for us, and uh, that's how we'll know, hey, we gotta make more of these videos, Brad. Down here, there's something down here. so funny I just knew to do that like I know this game a little too well <gasps> oh my god they're putting no they're putting enemies where they shouldn't be this shouldn't be I'm starting to realize that I don't know this game exactly like I think I do is that troll that ogre whatever it is that shouldn't be there that's not normally there oh my god I miss. I completely missed that counterattack. Oh well. If uh, if this video doesn't get a whole lot of likes or views, then what I'll end up doing is just uh, I'll just make this. I'll just do boss guides. Every time I reach a boss, then I'll record and be like, "Hey, this is how I beat this boss." But uh, oh my god, how am I supposed to kill that guy? What a freak. Come here, buddy. I'm trying to... There we go. Feel it. Right through your heart. <laughs> Look at him clipping through the floor. Oh, God. That ogre is going to cause some problems. I'll just hightail it to the bonfire. <laughs> I'm all wet. Light it up. All right, third bonfire down. Loser. All right, this is pretty crazy. Seeing ghosts. And now there's a stupid ogre, or cyclops, whatever you want to call it. There's a big, big bubba way over there. Actually, I know what I'm gonna do. I want to sit down, respawn the enemies here. I'm going to grind a little bit until I can get my first level up. So I want to level up, dang it. Oh, I completely missed. Alright, come on. What you want? There we go. Got the backstab. He's down. I keep trying to be fancy. I gotta keep doing that. Alright, I think that should be enough to level up. You know, I want to see what I can do with this guy. Can I take on this ogre? No. If it's being this generous, and thing isn't getting pissed off by me just standing right here, it's pro the game. that's probably the game saying, hey, you don't need to mess with that guy yet. So I'll just go back to Mojula and level up for the first time. Oh. 
Dude, that guy looks all cool. He's all big and buff. Alright, see, we'll go, we'll level up. Oh, I'm so happy. Bearer of the curse. Hey, baby. Seek souls. Larger, more powerful souls. Seek the king. That is the only way. Lest this land swallow you whole. As it has so many others, yes. First thing I'm gonna level up is my dexterity. Because... Once I find a bow, I want to be able to actually use it. And if you don't have a high enough dexterity, you can't use the bow. We're gonna go up here. End the episode on a high note. But dum tss. Joke. Oh my god, already this many people have been playing? Over a million deaths already, and the game came out today. I mean, I guess I can believe that. I can actually believe. That's not even that impressive. If it were in the three millions or something like that, hello. Because that's it, everybody playing at least once. Because I know the game's sold at least. Uh, okay, I'm not even going to try to give you an estimate of how many copies it sold. Because I would either way overshoot it or not give it enough credit. So that's where we're going to end the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm having a. Well, I already having a blast because just the game looks ten times better. It feels great. I love that there's it's even catching me off guard with some new enemies and places they shouldn't be. There's things happening that's throwing me way off. There's Hyde's Tower of Flame over there. That's where uh, the second boss I normally fight. People do it in different orders, but the second boss that I fight is over there. Anyhow, um, check out our website. For more news and reviews and editorials and cool stuff like that, like this video up if you want it to be a full video series of the whole game, just me playing with the commentary. Um, otherwise, I'll, I'll just upload the boss fights and uh, give you a guide for that. So, check out our website, and until the next video, play hard.